Hello dear friends, welcome to the world of mathematics. It's me Srija Suresh and you are watching SS Math Solutions. In this video, I am going to uh, discuss some previous scattered category 3 questions. Okay, let's go with examples. So, <clears throat> here is the question. The value of uh, root 9 plus 2 root 14 is options here in the bracket. Okay, how to find the value of this one? It's very easy. The only a uh, basic rule how to find. So we are calling this given root 9 plus 2 root 14 as x. Okay. So x I am writing here x is equal to root 9 plus 2 root 14. Okay. We need to remove this square, square root, right? So we are just, just squaring both sides. Okay. So squaring on both sides we will get x square is equal to after squaring this root will go right so after remaining answer is 9 plus 2 root 14 okay now i am writing this 9 we are changing to 7 plus 2 okay here also we can write 14 as 7 into 2 okay let's write here 7 plus 2 plus 2 root 14 i am writing this as root 7 into root 2 is okay so 7 plus 2 plus this 14 we changing to root 7 into root 2 again we can write this is root 7 and root 2 for just applying a equation right a plus b the whole square for that we are changing so 7 we can change it as root 7 square plus root 2 square root 7 square is 7 root 2 square is 2 plus 2 root 7 into root 2. Now, this is a square plus b square plus 2 times a into b. So, what is the equation? a plus b the whole square. So, we can write it as x square is equal to root 7 plus root 2 the whole square. So, x square is this one means therefore x is equal to root 7 plus root 2. This is the answer. So, option this is the answer root 7 plus root 2. Hope you understood. Let's, let's call given root 9 plus 2 root for an expression as x. Then just to squaring. So we need to apply a square plus b square. So we are changing the 7 and 2 with the root 7 and root 2. So we got this as x square. So x square is this one means x is equal to root 7 plus root 2. Hope you understood. So the question is here. The least number which when divided by 15, 20 and 28 leaves a remainder of 12, 17 and 25 respectively is. Okay, options here 837, 624, 484 and 417. So how to find? So the least number which when divided by 15, 20 and 28 leaves a remainder 12, 17 and 25. So one number we will divide with the 15, 20 and 28. The remainders are 12, 17 and 25. This is the question. So when you will get a question like this, the least number need to find means we just to take the LCM, least to common multiple. So which numbers LCM we are going to take? 15, 20 and 28 LCM. So of the LCM, 15, 20 and 28 LCM we need to find. Okay, so just uh, find with 5. So 5, 3 are 15, 5, 4 are 20, 28 is here. Now I am taking with the 4, so 3, 1 and 7. So the LCM is equal to 5 into 4 into 3 into 7. Right? 5 into 4 into 3 into 7. We will get it as 420. Hope you understood this much. When question is like that. Which is the least number we can completely divisible by 15, 20 and 28. Means the answer is this. But here the question is that. Reminder we need to reminder each case as 12, 17 and 25. When you will get like that. We, our numbers are 15, 20 and 28. Each case we need the reminder as 12, 17 and 25. Just to take that difference. Both the first two cases we got it as difference is 3. Here also 3 and 28 minus 25. Here also 3. So every case the, uh, uh, the number and the reminder difference is 3 each case so our number we need to uh, divide with the 15 20 and 28 we need the reminders as 12 17 and 25 so that number is this lcm minus this common difference 
So 420 minus 3 is equal to 417 is the answer. So every case this 470 we will divide with 15, 20 and 28. The remainders are 12, 17 and 25. Okay, hope you understood. So least number which when divided means the question is least common multiple we need to find. Okay, but here the question is we need the remainder each case given. So we are taking the differences from this number and the remainder and then our LCM minus this common number we got the answer. So here is our question. The coefficient of x raised to 49 in the product of x minus 1 into x minus 3 into x minus 5 etc. x minus 99 is options here 1 minus triple 9 that is minus 999 minus 1990 and minus 2500 these are the options. So how to find the coefficient of x raised to 49 in the product. We know that x minus 1, the product x minus 1 into x minus 2, etc. up to x minus n. What is the uh, expansion here? We can write it as x raised to n minus, right? This constant numbers 1 plus, 2 plus, etc. plus n into x raised to n minus 1 plus, etc. This is the equation. So, we need the x raised to 49. So, x raised to 49 coefficient only we need. Okay. So, we are writing like this with the help of this part. I am writing our expansion like this. Minus of. Okay. 1 plus 2. Sorry. 1 plus here. 1, 3, 5 like that. So, 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus etc. Plus 99 into x raised to 49. This is our new expansion we need to based on this expansion we are going to find hope you understood how we got this one from this we got this okay okay i arranged like this okay here we know that this is 135 etc plus 99 this is the sum of odd numbers from 1 to 99 okay so and this is in the form ap with the common difference 2 and the first term is 1 and the last term is 99 Okay, so we are applying the arithmetic progression here. So, how to write this? Minus 1 minus into first term plus last term we know that. So, we know that n by 2 uh, into t1 plus tn we know that, right? Okay, so the f n by 2. Okay, here the uh, problem 1, 3, 5, etc. plus 99 is here. The number of terms here, how is, which one is the number of term? Number of term is only 50. From 1 to 99 with odd number, the number of term is 50. Okay. So, n by 2 into t1 plus tn. This is our AP equation. So, minus of n is 50 only. Remember this one. This is odd number from 1 to 99. So, the number of terms here is 50. So, 50 divided by 2 into first term is 1 and the last term is 99. So, 1 plus 99. Okay, <clears throat> so minus of 50 by 2 into 100. Okay, 2 and 100 we can cancel with the 50. So 50 into 50 is minus is outside 2500. So our answer is minus 2500. Hope you understood. So remember this one never write this is a 99 term. So remember this one 1 to 99 is uh, this is odd number case so 1 to 99 the number of term is 50 only hope you understood